Do you want to learn how to distress your jeans? Well, I'm going to show you how to do it the DIY way. So stay tuned. Hey guys, Erin here with Wardrobe Packers, and today I'm going to show you how to distress your own jeans. So we know that distressed jeans are really popular right now. They're very much on trend, and um, they actually cost uh, the same amount as going out and buying a regular pair of jeans. So if you have some jeans in your closet, which we all do, that we no longer wear, instead of going out and buying a pair of distressed jeans, I'm going to show you how to do it. So all you're gonna need is a pair of jeans, some scissors, some tweezers, and a pen. That's it. So I've got my old jeans here, and um, some really great places that distress happens naturally is at the pockets, you know, below or above the knee, um, at the, you know, bottom of the pant, at the back pockets. All these places are really great ways uh, and places to distress your jeans. All right, so if you are wondering where to distress, some other options are to go on, you know, a jean company website, maybe, you know, Seven for All Mankind or True Religion and see where they have placed the distress on the jeans. All right, so let's get started. I am going to distress these jeans kind of above the knee right here. That's kind of where I've decided. And I don't want it to be as, um, big. I want kind of a smaller distress. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to take your pen and I'm going to mark on the jean just a little bit apart right here. As easy as that. Then I'm going to take my scissors and you're going to just want to cut right in between the two dots here, my two pin dots. You're gonna wanna do this in like a comfortable spot because distressing can, can take a little bit of time depending on how big your piece is. I'm just gonna cut that slit right in there, if you can see, and then I'm gonna cut to my pin mark in the perfect line right here. So just like that, all right? So then what I wanna do, I don't want this to be, you know, my whole knee. I just want it to be a little bit. So I'm gonna do um, another line parallel to this one, kind of right below it, right in here. So same kind of thing. You're just gonna make that slit right in there. and make that cut. You wanna be careful using the scissors, just not to cut yourself. Um, so there we have it. I've got my little piece in there and we're not gonna to wanna to cut this piece off. So this piece right here, we're gonna use two of our fingers to just rub the blue fibers out. And what's gonna happen is these white pieces of the jean the um, are gonna start showing, and those are what we are gonna wanna keep. So as I start rubbing, you will see lots of things starting to happen. Just really cool stuff, actually. And this is gonna take some time. Um, you know, this is probably gonna take a good 15, 20 minutes. So, you know, you could be in front of your television, um, you know, hanging out, watching a show or whatnot. Um, but you'll see, like I've got blue stuff coming off on my hand and that's all what we wanna kinda get off here. You don't wanna do this after you've had like a manicure. As you can see, I have not because it will turn your nails blue. Um, so once you kinda get this moving and growing, you're gonna want to let me see here, I got some more going on here. You can pull these, you'll see these pieces coming out. You're not gonna wanna do anything with them quite yet. At the end, you can go back and, and cut them off. So as you can see, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my tweezers and I'm gonna just gently pull through. You can see all this blue coming out 
takes an, you know, it, it can be a bit messy. So maybe having a trash can close by is really good. But as you can see, all these blue pieces are coming out right here. This is exactly what you want. Not to mess up all these white pieces in here because that's going to be your distressed part. I have spent lots of money on distressed jeans and I didn't think about doing it myself until recently on all my old pairs of jeans and it's really, I've really worn my jeans more often now. All right, so this is gonna be your end result after you've gotten all of your blue fibers out of the jean. So this is just a nice little distress piece right above the knee. I just really like the way it came out. And then what you can do is, you know, take some of the edging up here and just edge some of this as well, just to get some more of um, this blue fiber out, just to make it look a little bit more distressed. This is gonna be just more of a, um, like a polished distressed look. And uh, it's really super easy. Like I said, you can do it on your pockets. You can do it on the end of your jean, the leg. And um, it's just, it's fun. It adds texture to your jean and it also adds interest to your, to the outfit that you're wearing. Just a really great, fun thing to do to all those jeans that you're no longer wearing in your closet. All right, so after you're done distressing, any other points on your jeans, what you're gonna wanna do before you wear them is make sure that you throw them in the washer and dryer. This is just going to make it look extra good and um, it's definitely important to do. So make sure that you do that last step. All right, so I hope that you have found this helpful and if so, please share with your friends. You can follow us on social media and you can subscribe to our YouTube channel. It's Wardrobe Hackers. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.